So, and it, it's really just fresh off the dome. And I'm going to go ahead and talk about this, this problem with these baiting guys, man. And the reason why I say you just need to step away from it and don't even mess with it and focus on yourself. Because the thing about these dating gaps from girls that are foes, five, six, seven, eight, nine, it don't even matter what the range is. Majority of these women on these dating gaps, they're not looking for a guy. They're not looking for a relationship. They're just on here to waste your time, bro. They're only here, on here to really just waste your time. You will think you'll find an average girl. You might be like, well, I got a chance because I know I can get a girl better than her. Yeah, you can get a girl better, better than her outside of Tinder. Maybe on a, you meet her at a party or you meet her at the mall or whatever. But on Tinder, bro, these girls have an inflated mindset of what their actual value really is. Because there's so many guys trying to hit them up because they know that they have a chance. Because you got to think about it. Tinder is global. Uh, Facebook is like global. All this stuff is global. So they get all this attention from guys everywhere. I talked about this before. They get over like 200 uh, likes. You see an average girl. That's like a five. They get like freaking 200 likes on Facebook from random guys. And you like, dude, she don't even look that good. She's like average. Bad body and everything. You know, not trying to shame, but I'm just being honest. And you will see some of the most prettiest girls only get like 40 to 50. The reason why is because the, the mindset of, of simps and beta males is they'll see an average chick and believe they have a better chance to get an average chick than they do with a hot chick. So all the uh, beta males are trying to get with the average chick, which is inflating her ego to make it think, make her think that she looks better than what she is. That's the reason why a lot of women walk around thinking they all tens when they really ain't. Psychologically, they know they're not a ten, but they're getting all this attention and validation from average guys. So it ends up messing up the system it's the system in her mind basically because what now what she's thinking is she needs to get an above average guy because she gets so much attention from the average dudes even if the average dudes look way better than her this is why the, the game is so messed up and why i'm gonna go back to dating uh, to the dating guys because i got adhd i fly off the rim stay off of it because i know this happened with every other guy too thought it was just me you're a match with a girl and she doesn't hold any value in the conversation. You get three conversations in, the next thing you know, she doesn't respond, right? And you're the one that's holding it. You're asking her questions, what she's about. You're trying to figure out better ways to start the conversation. And after a while, you just say, man, bump this. I'm not even finna try to hold a good conversation. You get tired of it after a while because you know the game. The game is rigged for you to fail, bro. It really is rigged for you to fail. These girls are not trying to talk to you. They're not. They got one guy that they're interested in. And it's usually a guy that's completely out of their league. I'm telling you guys, you gotta think smarter about this. These girls are finessing you dudes. They just finessing you. So stay off of dating guys, man, and focus on you. Focus on getting yourself together in life.